Hello friends, welcome to our channel Kastor Classes and in this particular video, I am going to discuss how you can use help function to explore more in Python for different uh, methods and functions available in it for any particular data structure. Okay. So already uh, suppose consider the string data structure already I have discussed lots of functions and methods in string. Now if you want to get some more uh, functions which are available as inbuilt function in Python, you can just simply write help str. Okay, so I have already discussed the mostly used, frequently used and help, most helpful uh, functions for programming. Apart from those also lots of functions are available. You can just simply write help str and if you run, you'll be getting complete documentation and all the functions and inbuilt methods for this string okay like I can show you two three examples also like I have shown you the length okay length is uh, calculate the length okay so like that suppose capitalize okay return the capitalized version of the string how this works see I have not discussed capitalize earlier so let me use that suppose is equal to hello world okay I am writing then s dot capitalize let me just copy here copy this one so if i am writing s dot capitalize if i run see what we'll be getting hello world same we are getting because this is how we write in english right the first uh, should be only in capital letter rest all in small letter but suppose i am writing like this small letter h and capital letter w okay suppose i am defining g equal to hello world now if I write G dot capitalize again we will be getting hello world. So see this H is small this W is capital this should not happen only the first uh, character is capital so that is uh, capital and rest are small. So this capitalize is used for that return the capitalized version of this string okay like that count I have discussed that it returns the count value then some more examples you can check you can explore more here i am just showing some important among them like is a l n u m okay so return true if this string is an alphanumeric string false otherwise a string is alphanumeric if all the characters in this string are alphanumeric and there is at least one character in this string okay like here i am i can give suppose e equal to a 2 okay so this is alphanumeric so we can write e dot alphanumeric just here let me copy from here a l is a l n u m okay is a l n u m i'll be getting true but suppose i am giving this hash symbol this is not uh, alphabet not number right so if i run i'll be getting false okay like that some more important like here is alpha is alpha written true if this string is alphabetical string false otherwise there is no number value even uh, should not present only the alphabets of the english uh, dictionary suppose i am taking a b okay e dot is a l what is that p h l alpha okay fine so if i run i'll be getting true but suppose i am writing a b2 i'll be getting false so this is the difference in between is alpha and is l num l num is alpha numeric alphabet as well as numeric values is alpha means only alphabets okay like some more uh, important is lower and is upper okay is upper also you'll be getting somewhere here see what is upper does return true if this string is upper case string false otherwise is lower does the reverse thing that is written true if this string is lower case string false otherwise okay so let me write here one uh, example uh, suppose i am writing here suppose r is equal to hello okay r is dot is lower so see h is capital character so it is not completely lower case if you run it'll be getting false suppose i am writing small letter i'll be getting true because all are in small letter okay next example is upper suppose t equal to s c h double o only l i am keeping at small letter so if i am writing t is upper i'll be getting false but suppose if i am making l as capital i'll be getting true okay so like that is upper is lower is alpha is l num 
dot capitalize these things you can use for uh, practical programming also okay and help method will help you uh, for uh, exploring mode on uh, inbuilt uh, functions and methods available in python okay one more last thing i want to discuss that is step completion what is step completion see let me write that here i am writing as comment tab completion from the name itself you can understand something yes that is using tab we will complete our code how suppose i am writing w equal to suppose uh, hello python okay now suppose i want to do uh, apply some inbuilt method on it what you write w then give one dot then hit the tab okay you will be getting all the inbuilt uh, methods available okay like i have discussed uh, suppose index i have discussed right so w dot index and then i am suppose giving the uh, character l in it okay so what i will be getting i will be getting 2 because you know the index method returns the first uh, index position where the character is appearing okay so see l is appearing here this is what index 0 1 2 so output is 2 okay like uh, one more example of tab completion i can give w dot okay then hit the tab okay and then uh, suppose uh, i can take um, just any particular example okay let me take suppose is upper we can take okay then bracket open bracket close parenthesis open parenthesis close now tell me what we should get as output is upper returns true if all the characters are in upper case but here only h and p, uh, p in python are in uh, capital so it should return false see using tab just hitting the tab we can get all the list of the inbuilt methods and we can pick up according to our need okay so this is called tab completion i hope you have understood this small small concepts help uh, using help you can explore more using tab completion uh, you can uh, quickly write uh, the inbuilt uh, methods and check the list of the inbuilt methods in python okay this is what i want to discuss uh, in my this video this is all uh, for this particular video and if you find this video helpful please like share and comment and if you have not subscribed our channel till now don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos thank you for watching